guys, so today I'm going to be doing my August favorites and I am excited for this because it is finally September, which means this is the month of my birthday and I will be turning 15 and I am so excited. You guys don't even understand, like I just can't wait to be 15 and then 15 and a half and get my permit and then 16 and be able to drive and have my own car and be able to go wherever I want and I'm literally so excited to drive. Like like pretty much in a year I will be able to drive and I just mind blown. I had a really good August and I'm so excited to have a really good September because it's gonna be my birthday month and you know I'm gonna be celebrating every day. I'm just kidding. <laughs> but um, yeah I'm really excited and yeah I'm just gonna get started with my favorites. So I'm gonna start out with makeup and my first makeup product is the Benefit There Real Mascara and I am late on this bandwagon. I had a sample and I absolutely loved it but I never got around to buying the full size. I don't know why I just was always like, oh, drugstore mascara is fine, which it is, you know, I really like it, but drugstore mascara works really, really good, but I haven't found one that I'm like, oh my god, this mascara, mascara works good for people with short or long eyelashes, and I just love it. It's a great product, so check it out. Next makeup type product is the Proactive Green Tea Moisturizer. I am in love with this stuff. I got one at um, BeautyCon last year. Um where there was like not a lot of people there. I got one of these and I used the whole thing and then I got another one at Generation Beauty and I was so excited. Like I looked in my little goodie bag and there was one of these and I was like, oh my god, it is fake because I just ran out of my um, other one and so I'm really, really happy about this. It is, It works so good for any type of skin. It just smooths onto your skin and it sinks in so fast. So this is something that you can use before your makeup. And it um, is really moisturizing even though it sinks in really fast and like doesn't leave your face with like an oily residue. Next two makeup products kind of go hand in hand because this is what I use for my face like every day for school. So I put on Maybelline's Dream Fresh BB Cream. I am in love with this. I've been in love with it since the day it came out. Like I went out to the store and I bought it and I've gone through probably like two or three of them and I'm just in love with it. It works so well. It's SPF 30. I'm in the shade medium and I just put it on with this underneath. Um, this is the Revlon Color Stay Concealer. This is for under my eyes and for any blemishes because like it states in the name, Color Stay, it stays on forever and I hate when you have like blemishes and you like cover them up and then like you're in first period and like you look at yourself and you're like, oh cool like you can already see my zits and it's only first period I put this on like 30 minutes ago and you can already see my zits like that makes me so angry because like what's the point of, of putting on concealer if it just goes away in 30 minutes but this stuff stays on forever I'm obsessed with it these two together are just like the perfect face and I usually set it with like a light powder to keep myself um, not oily. Last makeup product is the Stila Stay All Day Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. This stuff is amazing. I've gone through one of them and I bought a new one pretty recently and I am obsessed with it. It makes such a like smooth line on your eyes and it stays on forever. It's a waterproof liquid eyeliner so if I'm wearing this and I end up going swimming like I did last night, I had some friends over and we went swimming and I wasn't planning on it and I just jumped in and it didn't come off so this is really really good I just have the black color and it's one of like the pen ones and it goes on so smoothly I'm really bad at putting on eyeliner but this is like practice makes perfect and this works pretty good like it's pretty easy to apply and I really really like it so definitely check this out if you're looking for a good like liquid pen eyeliner thing. <laughs> so that's all for makeup. I've been keeping it really really simple since I just started school and I don't have a lot of time in the morning because I like to sleep so I just put on like BB cream, concealer, powder, and then eyeliner and mascara so yeah it takes me like 10 minutes. Perfume favorite and unfortunately you can't buy this anymore but any of this brand's perfumes like they're all amazing and they last forever. This is the Ascada Taj Sunset T-A-J. I think I've mentioned this like a few times on my channel and I'm getting to like the low part of this perfume and I'm so sad because I absolutely love this. It's like so fruity and like it smells so good and I like put it on like in like maybe at like three or something and then like I went to a birthday party that night and I was like there and because I was spending the night it was 3 a.m. and someone's like what smells so good and I was like I don't know and they're like it's you and I was like what cuz I had been like dancing and just like hanging out and it was hot like in the house and stuff so 
I was wearing this for like all day and I still smelt. So these perfumes by Escada, they stay on forever and I'm sure they have another one that smells exactly like this or really similar from this brand. Then I have a hair product. This is in a giant container but I bought this at like a beauty supply and it's the Healthy Sexy Hair Soy Tri Wheat Leave-In Conditioner and they sell this in like a smaller bottle but this is like the giant one and I just put this in the like, probably from like ear down in my hair after I shower and it makes it so soft and it smells good and it makes it a lot easier to brush out and this was like $15 for the giant bottle and it's lasted me forever. Last like beauty-ish favorite is this and it's Johnson's Baby Head to Toe Wash and if you can see I don't I don't have a lot or like I haven't used a lot but um I use this to shave my legs and that sounds like really really weird but like my sister has really sensitive skin and she like um, breaks out into hives a lot so she uses this to shave her legs because like it's sensitive like it's for babies and stuff and she's like oh you have to try it, it makes your legs so soft so I was like okay so I like put it on my legs and whatever and then I shaved and oh my gosh my legs have never been so soft I didn't even need to use lotion get this it's like in a yellow bottle with a pump which makes it really easy and it was probably like three or four dollars I don't know I just it's works so good it's like so much better than shaving cream and it has so much in it and like shaving cream is just like annoying you know I use this it makes my legs so soft so definitely try this out if you want really really baby soft because like babies use this and their skin is always so soft so this works really good now on to like random ish favorites my first one is my wildflower case I have so many of these like, I have bought in them since like the beginning the beginning of their cases and like when I had my iPhone 4 and like I didn't even know the people who ran it and like I would buy their cases because I was like obsessed with them and then I like got in contact with the people who own it Sydney and Devin and their parents and they're all so so nice and I finally met them at BeautyCon and they're just like such amazing people and they're so funny so I definitely like follow them on Twitter and Instagram I'll put theirs down below I got this case while I was at BeautyCon they gifted it to me because they are the nicest people in the world but it's just like a floral one and it has um, silver pyramid studs and I am in love with it the like these are such good quality and they're like handmade and the studs stay on like people always ask me like oh do the studs ever fall off like no they stay on forever next thing I have been obsessed with in the month of August is socks I'm obsessed with socks like crew socks and I don't know I just love the way they look with like high top converse and stuff and like if you scrunch them down a little bit I just love them and yeah so I'm gonna show you a few of the pairs that I have I have these ones which I think they shrunk which is really annoying but it's okay they're from stance and they're like this really fun like Hawaiian print and they have like this like it like scrunches in right here and it makes it really really comfortable I love these socks I bought them at Jack's I think which is like a surf shop I don't know they have them like online or like in zoomies and places like that next pair I have are some from um, odd future they have like a ton of socks and I really want more pairs right now I have like four pairs I think of odd future socks and I really want the pink ones with the tacos on them they're amazing but these ones are the watermelon ones and Kylie Jenner has ones really similar to this but I think they're the Arthur George socks which are is her like brother's line of socks but I saw these and I was like oh my god I'm obsessed with them not just because Kylie Jenner has them but like how can you not like these like they're so cute and I wear them like my all black converse and I just love them I think they're adorable and I bought these at Zoomies everyone always asks me I post a picture on Instagram of these and people are like where did you get those so yeah they're odd future socks and then I have these ones which are also odd future and they're like this crazy like striped print say golf wang in the yellow strips I really really like these I just got them recently and I haven't worn them yet but I I'm in love with them and I can't wait to wear them. I'm probably gonna wear them on like Wednesday to school or something next pair of socks is from active and they're from the girls active line and they say like active around here and they're just like pastel colors and they're so so cute and I love them I love active socks I have like a ton more pairs but I just thought these were really cute and they're my favorite ones so yeah and then I have the donut ones from um, Odd Future, and I died. Like, I love donuts, and I love Odd Future. Like, people, like, I post a picture of um, my new Odd Future socks, and they're like, you don't even like Odd Future. Like, you're just jumping on the bag bandwagon. Like, I, sorry I have good taste in music. Sorry a white girl can't like good music. I don't, God forbid, I like good music. I, who knows, like, you spot those because 
you jumped on the bandwagon, like, because it's cool to, like, God Future. I'm like, no, like, I like them. But anyways, <laughs> these are, like, the same color as the active ones. And the active ones are a little bit more blue, but these are so cute. And they have donuts on the side. And I love them. And I bought these from Zoomies, too. My next favorite is my backpack. And this is my school bag. And oddly enough, it, like, matches my shirt. But um, this is from Urban Outfitters. And it was on sale. Like, original price for this was, like, $70. And I was like, I'm not paying $70 for that. But then I was like, oh, it's on sale for $40. And they, this comes in red, too. And it's just, like, a backpack. And it's really cool. It has a ton of compartments, and this zipper, like, goes into the backpack from the back, so if you need to, like, I don't know, like, sneakily put something in there. And then there's, like, a little flap right here, and that flap has a pocket that you can put stuff in. And then it's just, like, a drawstring like that, and it opens up, and there's, like, some pockets for, like, your phone or whatever, and, like, a zipper pocket in the inside, and it has so many compartments to put your stuff. And if you guys want a what's in my backpack, thumbs this video up and comment down below and I will do that for you. Then I have like another pouch right here and then a pouch right here and then a zipper pocket right here and then two pouches on the side. There's like so much storage in this backpack which I really really like and it fits like my school books and stuff and it's really cute and yeah. So that is all for this favorites video. If you have an August favorites you can comment down below and tell me what your favorites are for the month or leave me a video response and I would love to know what your favorites are and what you guys think that I should check out that I'm missing out on and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!